Okay, everybody, it's your boy Alex. We're in Higgins Hall now. We're going to go to the science building. So, enjoy the trip. So, this is the lounge area. And now we're going to go to the science building, which is outside and down the road. And then we will get to the graduation ceremony. Turns out, Brenda already has a videographer filming for her, so it's no big deal to me. I'll still film for her sake. Um, but here's the science building, everybody. This is the furthest building away from Whitehall. This is where I also used to go and um, where I used to go and um, do a lot of work. My work was on the second floor. See where the door is? Let me see where the door is. It's a little far away. See where the door is just above it? That's where I used to go. And I used to go there because it took me a long time to get there and it made no sense for me to even like attempt to get back. So it was a nice place. I'll show you where I used to go, where to study or to have fun or chat. Since there's no one on campus, it's not like I'm gonna be um, violating any privacy because I'm being filmed right now, technically recording cameras security cameras obviously plus the GoPro right now but it doesn't count so let's see if the building is open please use the other door okay sure thing these used to be automatic now they're manual Oh, nice AC rushes in, hits the camera and me full force in the face. Nice and warm outside though. Don't mind that. Oh, and there's another building that is being built right there. That gray building right there. That was being, that was under construction while I was here. Just at the end of my year here. They, uh, we're building that. But you know, construction sometimes can take such a long time because the resources, the money. Oh, Westcon's oozing with money, but it's a non-profit at the same time. So, so we're going up these stairs. Look at this beautiful view of the garden, of the greenhouse. More stairs. And this is the lounge area. Someone's in my spot, but that's all right. So this is a quiet spot work. They have two lounges here. Don't close the door for privacy. You know, literally there's no privacy here. So this is the view. It's better in the winter time. I promise you it is. But all this graffiti on the glass. Don't know why people write on the glass. I really don't understand that. Like C E D nine, what the heck does that stand for? C E D C E D three, like what what are you talking about? Oh worms, they die. Lives. It's pretty cool though. Again, this is high school, so people are allowed to run the windows. I guess. It's just for like oh they can't afford a whiteboard, I guess. The whiteboard's literally right here. There's literally a whiteboard right here. Like there's no point. Oh, 
I should show you guys the pool room. Oh, oh yes, the pool room. Oh, interesting. It's probably closed. But let's take a trip. Let's go to the pool room. So you see, this is where I used to work. And this interesting sculpture represents an eye, an E-Y-E. -E. If you look at it from below, like if we're to look at it from here, from below, look up, the sunlight and the lights from up the ceiling, looks like an eye, looks like a human eye. It's pretty cool. Let's go to the pool room, and that will be the end of my tour before I have to film the graduation event. So, that'd be fun. Graduation at WestCon was last week, I believe. So we're gonna take a nice, long, leisurely walk. When the place doesn't start till six, I'm gonna be here till 5.15. I'm gonna get there at 5.15 or before Mr. Alicia and Mr. K come. Oh yeah, this is stuff. Uh, the, yep, it's right over there. Unfortunately, I have to follow the paths. I can't cut across the lawn. That's just illegal. No, I'm not joking, it's not illegal. Anyone can do it, but it doesn't feel right. We're just gonna follow the sidewalk here. It's probably closed. My student ID can't get me in either. But we'll talk about that sooner. Sooner or later. I deserve to come back on campus or not. So this is the way, that's the science building. As you see, the view that you just saw is up there. That is a nice view. Very cool view. Really worth it. Totally worth it. The view. Again, like it's better in the winter time. Not so much in the summertime. Even though nature does look beautiful out here on campus. But uh I think it's better with uh in winter time I think I could be wrong but and so seniors or graduates also decorate those rocks those rocks have been painted over for years Again, this is only my first year here, and it won't be my last year here. I'm gonna to try to go to college here, but I'm gonna need the experience of a college level to get me to college, so. Um, so, as you guys might not know, this is a state-run university, Connecticut State University. They have a pride walk for all the LGBTQ community people now I did not know that they supported those but they do I don't mind because I'm not one of them but just saying to me it's kind of weird when I first got the emails ex explaining what was going on on the campus I was like what the heck what is this like they're actually considering it and they did they actually considered it, and I was like, wait, I was torn between like, jumping for joy and like, loop throwing up. So, that's just my opinion. Nobody's gonna watch this, so. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Well, you know what, another place I can show you. Uh, if I can get there in time. What time is it? Mr. Lisi gonna be there. They'll be there at 5:30. Okay, so they just arrived. That's fine.
So I'm gonna show you my old work site. Uh, it's still my first work site. Oh, this place is closed, so can't get in my first work site. It's a mail room. It was my first work site. My second work site. It's obviously it's closed now because it's way late, but um There we go. That this is the center of Westcon. Which if you guys don't know, if you clap your hands, it echoes. The only place you step on that stone and you don't get any other sound. You don't it's not it's not the same. It's built different. I don't know how with how it works, but it was a cool feature when I was walking here. Oh, police car getting towed. Now to be safe. That's not safe. The cars have to stop in the other direction. Thank you. So I can cross the street safely. So I could have gone off the bridge. I should have done that, but whatever. We'll do that on our way back. So walking down here. It was a pretty decently long walk. It took a good eight minutes to get down here. Depending on which method you chose. I chose the fastest route from our Whitehall place. So we're gonna go down here. This is not the area. This building here is not it. It's, this is the parking lot, obviously, in front of me. But the building to the right of it, behind it, where that car just came from, is where shipping and receiving is. I don't think I can go in. I'm not going to go in. I'm going to show you the building from the outside and then we're going to walk through the garage back to the graduation ceremony. Okay? Cool. So guys, this is it. Shipping and receiving. Uh, I don't know what the address is, but it doesn't matter. So, here's the building. WCSU shipping and receiving. There you go, guys. That's the big building. It's huge. It is gigantic. If you don't know, this is where they store their golf carts. They use golf carts to get around campus and to deliver the mail. So, part two of our walk back, I'll continue. Peace.